Today we are going to be talking about Properties NFT. Pre-sale for this project started today and Public Mint starts in two days. Welcome back to LimeTube and if you enjoy my videos please leave a like, comment and subscribe as it really motivates me to create more content for you. It's free to do so and it helps me massively. The reason I decided to create a video about the Properties NFT is due to the fact that Crypto Dads were holding a whitelist giveaway for Crypto Dad and Mum holders. They were giving away 40 whitelist spots on Discord and 35 on Twitter. I was successful in obtaining a whitelist spot and here Rusky says we are excited to announce our new amazing partnership with Properties. The partnership is to build a one of a kind experience on Sandbox, a man cave that is second to none, the dream of every parent, young and old, skinny, chubby and chubbier, a place to make dad jokes without the embarrassed stare of your oldest daughter, a place where mums don't have to wear makeup, a place in which jorts and baseball hats from the 80s are considered business casual, a place where mums can drink cheap beer and not get judged, a place in which dad and mum bods are part of the tribal nature of the community. Property is building a social hub on Sandbox, in which the crypto dads will be the neighbours of many other projects. Let's see who's fast at mowing the lawn, future neighbours. So I was able to get a whitelist spot through one of these giveaways. So let's check out their website. This is how the website looks like. It looks very clean. This is focused around community centred experiences in an immersive world. There are currently 6,000 NFT homes waiting for new owners. It's our world. Let's make it personal. Pre-sale has already begun for properties. It started about two hours ago. And they have premium partnerships with Landvault, Exclusible and Metamundo. There's a lot of similarities between this and Ethereum Towers. This is all about bringing the metaverse to life with NFTs. These 6,000 NFTs give you creative control over property worlds, own assets that make your world more colourful and fun. It looks like there are different sets of colours for each NFT, a bit like Monopoly. The colour represents a certain trait. Each coloured NFT has a similar visual to it. Moving on to the metaverse, curated digital experiences. Fully immerse yourself in a limitless world on Sandbox. With properties, all of your favourite experiences are in one place. Social and adventures, meet others and enjoy the metaverse together. Gaming and content, play all the games and even create your own. Music and events, relax and have fun at different events across the world. Art and shopping, admire art and purchase your own to fit your unique look. Like, like I said, this is following a lot of similarities to Ethereum Towers. However, Properties is on Sandbox. The team, not any noticeable names that I know of. However, they have given their full names, so I like that they're being transparent. Similarly with the advisory board, they were giving out partnership opportunities to different communities. And as mentioned, Crypto Dads is one of them. And as you can see, scrolling around is a couple of others such as Bones Club, SOS, Bubble Buds, Nifty Labs, Fluffy Polar Bears, MC, not sure what that is, Meta Guardians, Ninja Squad, Galaxy Flight Club, Meta Mundo, Peaceful Groupies, Llamaverse, Land Vault, Exclusible, Sci-Fi, Nice Fun Zombies, Royal Ceramic Club, Yondo Mondo, Crypto Barristers, and I believe we're back at the start. Moving on to the FAQ. So what is Properties? Properties is an NFT collecting game on Ethereum that combines metaverse applications and reward based collecting. NFT holders will become a part of our ecosystem and have creative power over a majority of our world on Sandbox. Pre-sale started today at 3 p.m. UK time and public sale starts 12th of December at 3 p.m. So there is a company behind this and the idea is generated from a product of our interest. We are far more than just an NFT image. We create immersive metaverse worlds, host communities, integrate ideas and position brands. We are a social network of metaverses. We are building an ecosystem that our NFT holders can be a part of. What's special about properties versus other NFT projects? A lot. We are focused on long term and aim for excellence in everything we do, from the team to its advisors, from the mechanics to the technological development, from the community to the underlying utility. We try to differentiate ourselves in all of those regards. We pride ourselves in thinking ahead flexibly and being 100% community centred. Their first collection will hold 6,000 NFTs and there will be 5,880 regular houses and 120 special buildings. Taking a look at their Twitter page, they have 12.7k followers, so one NFT for every two followers they have. 
Now, obviously, not all followers are there to be purchasing an NFT. Similarly, their Discord has about 12,000 users too. They've also got an FAQ here, and I'll go through some of the answers which haven't been answered yet on their website. Here you can see that there's different prices given away to different members of the group. So a property agent gets one NFT at 0.08 Ethereum. A senior broker gets two NFTs for 0.0725 Ethereum. An executive realtor gets three NFTs at 0.065 Ethereum each. And a partner or giveaway gets one NFT at 0.08 Ethereum. Public Mint is 0.09 Ethereum. And these agents, brokers and realtors are determined by your level on their Discord. You can mint one to four NFTs per wallet during pre-sale, depending on what role you have. And during public sale, you can mint eight NFTs per transaction and hold a maximum of 16 in your wallet. What does it mean to hold a property's NFT? Do I own the land? No, owning an NFT does not entitle you to own a part of land on our plot in Sandbox. However, holding one or several NFTs rewards you with bricks, which can be used in our ecosystem only. They do not provide any financial reward. What exactly can bricks be used for? Bricks can be used in our ecosystem only. You'll be able to purchase things from our upcoming merch drop with it and you'll be able to spend it on accessories, etc. to be used in the metaverse on Sandbox. Who is entitled for earnings bricks? Single NFT owners will be receiving bricks. Apart from that, please see below. If you own a street, which is seven properties, you get a small bonus. If you own a district, which is three streets, you get a medium bonus. A city, four districts, a large bonus. And if you own a special property, you will get a special bonus. So they've not really disclosed a lot about bricks yet. Will we have to stake NFTs to generate bricks? No, we won't. Are we going to be able to log on to Sandbox and walk into the properties metaverse? If so, when? Yes, as soon as Sandbox launches, plan for quarter one 2022, we'll be welcoming you guys onto our plot. Can I get a sneak peek of what Sandbox is like? There are regular streaming throughout the Sandbox alpha phase and we'll also upload videos about this in the future. There is a Meet the Team channel on their Discord so you can run through and try to get some more information on who's in the team. As I mentioned, pre-sale has already launched. It's been live for about 2 hours 46 at the time of recording this video and there has been 326 properties minted. The current floor price is at 0.139 Ethereum. So if we take the most expensive mint price, which would have been 0.08 Ethereum, it's about a 75% increase from the mint price. But after accounting gas, there's not too much room for profit here. This, this number keeps updating and there's currently 392 minted. And if I click buy now, 38 of them are for sale. So about 10% have been listed. And because this has just launched, the price will definitely be very volatile. Looking at the volume traded, 3.2 Ethereum, so a few have already sold. We're looking at 25 sales of an average price of 0.147 Ethereum. We can see the highest sold was 0.22 Ethereum, which was the very first one. I guess the question remains, will I be minting a property NFT? I am still on the fence about this. I am doing a bit of research before I decide to buy. I will be keeping an eye out on OpenSea to see what's happening with the floor price and how many people have minted during pre-sale. I'm not sure how many NFTs were available for pre-sale either. So I'll try to find that information out and keep an eye out on the percentage which is minted. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below about the properties NFT. Do you see the potential with this? There's a lot of similarities with this and Ethereum Towers. Are you going to be buying? Did you make whitelist? And how do you see this playing out over the long term with Sandbox Incorporated? As always, if you enjoy my videos, please leave a like, comment and subscribe as it really motivates me to create more content for you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.